got three minutes. Three to one blast off. Ah, welcome to Pine Needles Quilt and Sew in Rochester, Minnesota for the Marsha and Joy show here today on a Thursday. Thursday, not it, Wednesday. It truly is the second half of the week, isn't it? Well, Marcia? it truly is. We rolled right over that hill. Very much apologize for that, but there was nothing, absolutely nothing we could have done about the outage with the internet yesterday. And I think you would have all been really disappointed because it was going to cut out and not be complete. And then we kind of thought for a little bit about recording it and then playing it later. But then, how would you get the prizes? I don't know. And they are important, aren't they? I know. They are. And my joke would not be nearly so funny. So today, Thursday, we have the Marsha and Joy Show <laughs> coming to you live. And we're so excited to be here. Joy and I just got done with lunch. We did. Kind of had a late lunch. We weren't going to eat lunch. Then we decided we were. And so we did. So you know that I'm doing a series in January of snowman jokes. So last week we said, what do snowmen eat for breakfast? And that was snowflakes. So uh, Joy... Uh, uh. Today, do you know what a snowflake, snowflake, snowman eats for lunch? Chicken noodle soup? Nope. <laughs> what do snowmen eat for lunch, Marcia? Icebergers! Oh, Yay! man! They're good ones! It is. So, yeah. Are your sounds broken yet? It is. I had it going yesterday, and now for some reason... Now we have internet and no sounds. It's not. Working. So you're all cheering at home. Yes, of course you are. And you're going to tell that joke over again. I'm sure you are. Absolutely. I already did. Yeah. So 
Um, just a little bit ago, like when we were setting up for this, there's boxes and boxes and boxes that just came in. Our favorite things brown from our boxes. friends at Moda Fabric. We've been waiting for a long time. I happen to know that this fabric is in there, Joy. It is. Mm -hmm. This new fabric is called Cider from Sorry. Basic Gray by Moda. So we'll be putting that out. And you know, when we were looking at the new fabrics, we saw a lot of this and this, didn't we? We did. These two colors. These are the hot new colors. This kind of turquoise aqua color with the pretty golden colors here. Mustardy kind of. Yeah. But it comes in more. There's more. And look at there's uh, um, apricots and what is this? This is some more like light teal. Yep. This is a lush. little bit less. This one's a little brighter orangey melony color. But what I'm also very excited about, if you can flip these up, they have, they are introducing seven new grunge colors. That coordinate with the line. Yep. And then here's really a nice brown one. So anyways, this is a great line that's coming in. It's 40 pieces. Um, and it will be here. And we're kind of excited about this because we are making a quilt for a local designer. Um, that's going to be featured in a magazine and the quilts are going to come from here at Pine Needles Quilt and Sew. So we're really excited about that. So I am finishing up the quilt and hopefully by the time the new magazine comes out, we'll have the kits ready to go for that and the quilt hanging. I wish it was in the new store. Maybe it'll be in the new store. But it's amazing piecing people. Let me just tell you, I, I cannot wait to cool. see it in one entire chunk. Yep, it is. It's a quilt that's a 12 and a half inch block and it's um, 45 pieces in one quilt block and there are 56 blocks in there. <sighs> and it's sewing. That's like a, 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 a long-term jigsaw puzzle project. It really project, is. Isn't it, it kind of is. It's a, great, it's a great project and it's not hard. It just um, takes a little bit of time. But it's yes. brainless sewing. You can just put the pieces in and you don't really have to think. So I kind of had some Hallmark movies on as I was working on that over the new year. And hopefully this weekend I'll get it finished. So watch for that here at Pine Needles Quilts and Sew to be hanging. And as she said, the fabric just came through the back door and it will be available to purchase very soon. Yes, absolutely. As soon as the girls can get the, as soon as we get the quilt done and the girls can get the kits made. Right. So it uses um, a lot of fat quarters. It's a fat quarter quilt too. So it'd be a pattern you could use for something else as well. So enough on that. Get you all excited. But something else to get excited about that's coming up. We talked about the brown bags. Oh. Oh, okay. Sorry, I'm going she's, out of order. She's not letting me talk about the sewing machine. Stay tuned. I'm going for that. out of order. But that's okay. But, you know, lunch. You remember when you used to take your lunch to school in a brown bag? Yes. On those special field trips that you got every once in a while? Yes. Wow. Weren't they always special? They were special. So this is the brown bag mystery. Now, we're just kind of giving you a sneak peek right now because we want you to know about this. For those of you that participated last year, you know that it was really a lot of fun. And this is one that's also, it's sponsored by the symposium shops and also Karen Montgomery will be doing all of the uh, videos on making this quilt. But what you will find on the outside of your bag is a piece of one of the major fabrics that's in there. This one is from Tula Pink. But what we're doing different this year, because we listened to you, we heard you, is you can buy your bag and you could pick up your border at the same time. And we have a few choices. We do. So this is the Tula Pink. So any one of these three borders will coordinate with what is in yes, this bag. Yes, you can pick your border if you want. It's, a, it's an additional cost, but you know, last year, you know, by the time this got over, because it starts on International Quilting Day, which is March 20th but they're gonna open up. You can start buying your bags Ju January 15th. So next Friday, a week from tomorrow. And then they're opening up the Facebook page on February 1st and there's gonna be some fun introductory things about the shops and hopefully, oh, I don't know. But you can either choose to have your clue February 1st, yes. February 1st, yes. So on February 1st, you can join the Facebook page. You can join the, the Facebook page. The clues get mailed in March. March 19th, the first clue will leave our shop into the post office's hand 
or you can pick it up here in the store if you want to get yours faster if you're Correct. nearby. What's a little bit different this year is that Karen Montgomery is doing the clues and as she posts, I think it's going to be on two, Mondays or Tuesdays, I can't remember. The, I think we mail the clue on Mondays. Uh, more information later, but she is also going to like give you the measurements so that even, you need on right the so even page. though you won't maybe have that paper in your hand yet it we got so many complaints last year because of covid that you know the mailing was late and everything so while you're not going to see the printed she's going to give you the measurements of what to cut and sewing instructions well you'll have your cutting instructions because those will come in the bag right but then to the sewing instructions she's going to give you the information uh, each week on the thing. This is a six week program. Starts on um, March 20th. A great spring project. So these are two of the n 10 kits that we're going to have. So this one's going to, and I will tell you that the fabrics that are in each of these bags, I forget what this one was called, but um, they co they are from the same line. Inside the bag. They Inside the bag, yes. Yep. Except maybe the background. The, that one is a tone on tone and it might not exactly be from this line because it didn't contrast right you know we needed some really tone and tone so this is exciting you're definitely going to want to do the brown bag mystery at 79.99 it's over seven yards of fabric and then you can get this whichever co color you want first come first serve because we cut up the whole bolts um whichever color way you want for just twenty dollars more and this is two and a fourth yards so a great deal it is cannot sign up until January 15th. We're giving so you a Friday morning, January 15th. Sneak peek of all of this. And um, we'll probably, is that next week? Next Friday. So next Wednesday, we'll probably show them the rest of the colorways. You still won't be able to um, sign up, but we'll show you the other eight colorways that we have. Yes. Right. Well, gosh, I left that in the office. I was just taping up the rule page. Right, it's a little bit bigger this time. Um, hence the seven yards of fabric, plus you have two and a fourth yards. We will let you know what the size is next time. So if you wanted to add the borders, uh, Karen said it is a twin size quilt. So it will be a very large lap size quilt. And again, since we're just giving you a preview, the details are yet to come. Because we do have other things that we are fully detailed Well, we're today. so excited about everything, though, because it's a new year. It is a new year. Absolutely. New year, new quilts. And, Absolutely. you know, we live in Minnesota. You have to have snow projects here. You do. Because I think that's in the forecast for tomorrow. I know. Susie and I were just talking on the way to work that it was 20-some degrees, and we're like, usually it might be 20 below at this time. Right. So we're feeling pretty fortunate. I will let you talk about this beautiful new <laughs> sewing machine now. All right. So earlier this fall... We had the uh, introduction of the, whoa, watch out for your cords, darling, oh. B790. I plugged this into a different port, darling. She's got a short one. Sweetheart. We had a uh, combination deal of a 790 with this 480. Until today, or recently, we didn't have the 480s to sell by themselves. Now, those combinations are gone. They're all sold, and there won't be more. But we do have this lovely Bernina 480 available for you to purchase. This is a standard size sewing machine, but it has outstanding LED lighting underneath around the needle area. It has a nine millimeter stitch area. So if you want to customize your wording or have a wider design, that is available to you. On this amazing machine, there is also a jumbo bobbin. And yesterday I had this bobbin out and I'm going to leave it in today because now it's on the front side. It's okay. But what I want you to know is the same jumbo bobbin that is on our big 5 series and 7 series machines, equivalent of three standard bobbins. So if you are a um, 7 series Bernina owner, this machine is extremely compatible with your machine. It has a large touch screen on it. It has built-in scissors. It has, of course, several needle positions that's on this other side here. The knobs are amazing when you're sewing because you can adjust your stitch width and length while you're sewing. You don't have to wait and stop and put your needle up. It has precision sewing. It is Swiss engineered and designed. And this amazing machine also comes with the much coveted walking foot as an extra bonus accessory. And wait, there's more, Marsha. There is. I don't, you really can't see the design on the front of this, but this is a beautiful etched design. And look, you also get the luggage that, are you able to, 
Well, you I can have, have the see, luggage. I want them to see the design on that the goes front. With it. There you can see it. So bit. this is a, a beautiful mm -hmm. limited edition sewing machine and you get the exclusive luggage, luggage that goes, that with, goes it. with it. And a walking foot. But can you see this beautiful, beautiful design? And it's a very good price. And well. again, we can't advertise the prices mm -hmm. here on our show. But if you call or stop into the shop, we'd be happy to give you that information. Or if you wanted to email us, we can also share that information that way. But this is a wonderful machine to use as your primary machine or to have a smaller second machine to go with your uh, other bigger machine. So check that out. It is the 480 Bernina Special Edition machine. And it is a beauty. It is. You deserve it. You do. Absolutely. Okay. And it's pretty too. You know, do you remember, remember Virginia? We absolutely love Virginia. She was a favorite customer here. Mm -hmm. And she bought one of the little, was it Tula Pink or one of those little S limited edition, edition machines. sewing machines? And she said, you know, some people buy themselves flowers every week. I am buying myself this beautiful machine and I am going to leave it sit on my table just to look at because it is so beautiful. So there you go. I'm never going to forget that. I'm never going to forget Virginia either. She was some, um, she came in just about every week and we certainly do miss her. She was really fun. We do. So we have, because it's a new year and there. we are not going to sing, but Marsha might. My favorite color. Oh yeah. These are a few of my favorite things. We are. We had the brown bay. on roses and whiskers on kittens. Brown paper packages, <laughs> which we already talked about. Yeah, there we go. So this is something new, and we wanted to show you this because this we talked about a little bit last time, and this is my favorite color is, is and it is Moda. And I think I have a little fun and This thing. one is called Cookie Tin. And, you know, it is... Um, kind of the best kind of cookie tin there is because it is full of fun. It is. Anyways, this is over, this is like 17 and a half yards of fabric. I just wanted to show you how much fabric you get in your bundle. And then you also get this little workbook. And this is... That sounds terrible. Workbook. Um, a fun a book. fun book. A playbook. This is your playbook. Oh, I like that better. Yeah, <laughs> and it's got all the different colorways. There's six different colorways we're going to be offering. And then you're going to follow along on the blog post with um, National Designers from Moda. It's got all the cutting instructions. And then it's 36 blocks from 6 and a half inches, I think, to 31 and a half inches or something That's like that. That's a big block. But it's a little <laughs> bit every month. It goes um, on. There. We're going to kick it off on January 19th. You can get your kits now. Um, actually, Moda. We're going to follow along with Moda. And our own Keely is also going to do blog posts for, you'll have Moda's blog posts and you'll also have hers. She's going to um, work along with you as well. So lots of fun. This is one that you can do at home. This is just a little bit each month. And February, the actual sewing is February through December. Just a little bit. And then you have a beautiful, beautiful quilt done for Christmas. And these you can pre-order now. And your color choices are you online. Can. And you know, we had one savvy shopper yesterday, Marcia. She went ahead and ordered her backing. That's a very good idea, To too. match her front. These are all Mel Motabella solids. It's going to be an amazing program. Um, the fabrics are not here yet. But as soon as they are, we're hoping to mail them right after the week of the 20th so that you'll have them for the 19th. So we'll get them done as quickly as we have the fabric in hand. All right. And hopefully some of that walked through the back door today. I know it. Who knows? I know it. So this it's is kind of our block of the month, a little bit every month. That um, brown bag is a spring project that you can do six weeks. Um, six weeks and done. Fun with Karen Montgomery. we got lots of things going on. Speaking of fun things. Many of you have taken, and I know many of you are waiting for the next round of Brenda's classes on quilting with a walking foot. So that is coming again on January. Susie's well, we'll going to post the, the link. To you. It's but, in a couple weeks. But meanwhile, 21st, January 21st at 10 o'clock. And Brenda would like to help you learn to quilt with a walking foot. It's right. the first class that we have. Any brand machine will work. 
And we have walking feet available to purchase for both foot. Bernina and Baby Locks. So this is a Storm at Sea pattern that she did in just three, um, three fabrics. So a great easy or easier project to do. But as you can see, this is all done with her walking foot. I believe she might have used a ruler out here with her walking foot. Maybe. She'll tell you because this is one of the featured quilts. She has a stack of quilts. Oh, thank you. Our favorite color is still there. Thank you. I'm here. Thank you. Thank you for telling me to do that because I forget. But this has got wonderful straight line quilting. It really does. And um, she's going to show you how to all do this on your walking foot on with your domestic machine. And then this is a cute little thing she did as well. And this is done with her walking foot, but this one is done with decorative stitches. All decorative stitches in here. So sometimes you never think, oh my gosh, I got this machine with... 5,000 decorative stitches, what shall I ever do with you? Do with them. She's going to show you what you can do with your decorative stitches on your quilting side as well. So this is something if you have been wanting to learn to quilt your own quilts on your domestic machine um, with a walking foot, this class is definitely for you. And Brenda is definitely the teacher that you want to teach you because she's amazing. And just a quick little uh, note, you are on a public Facebook group page right now watching us live. Anyone can join in and see this. These classes that we have, like uh, Brenda's class, are private group page classes. And to be a part of that group, you have to not only register, but you need to ask to join that group. So be sure you do that early on when you've registered. Uh, check it out, search for the group. It's always Pine Needles Quilton So usually the month and then the name of the class but usually when you type in pine needles quilt and sew you get a list of our other group pages that are linked to our store brenda will put you in the group and she will tell you what you need before you get started and then on the day of class she takes you step by step through a, a wonderful tour of her quilts and how f for you to do your own susie yes they're asking if my favorite color be can be converted to Probably with a little I'm bit of extra some, math. But not all. Sh Susie is actually making this one right now. This one's called Cookie Tin. And she says you can do some, but not all. So this is. You maybe could do all, but I'm not just because I'm doing what's easy. Yep. We won't have directions for how to do it with AccuQuilt. So you would have to figure that out for yourself because this really is a, um, while we're participating, this really is a MOTA program. Yep. So, yep. So. Good question. Do though. we have some some like, comment, and share prizes, oh, Marcia? Yes, we do. So for those of you that are joining us first time, um, if you like any of these or that you'd like to participate from near or far in any of our programs or um, purchase any of the things that we have featured today, um, Susie posts in the comments, and then she also has a page of all the sale items that we talk about as well. So you order those from our web store, and you can do that later. You don't need to do it while you're watching you can go check it out later um, so you don't miss anything here but also if you like comment and share we have some cute socks from our friends at moda so this time next after i get done showing these we're going to have a trivia question and the winner of the trivia question will win one of these pairs of socks and then on our saturday email um, we will post the other winners, um, and those are chosen by Rafflecopter. So like, comment, and share, and you might get one of these fun, fun pairs of socks from Moda. Uh, so, uh, do y'all have your brain, mental, uh, what would we want to call them? Who's sharpened thinking up for the hats trivia? On. Yes, thinking, thinking hats, hats on. For our trivia question. So, there it is. The trivia question for today is a quilt in which each piece is cut from a different fabric is called a blank quilt. So for those quilts that are each piece is cut from a different fabric is called a blank quilt. And the quilt. first one to answer correctly gets a pair of socks. Yes, and they're fabulous. All right. So Susie will let us know as soon as she... Oh! Yay for someone. Who? Sherry Whalen. Sherry Whalen. Yay for you. The answer is it is a charm quilt. So Sherry, I will have a pair of these socks with your name on them. 
Yay! And you know, I was talking about the weekly email. Um, it's coming out on Saturday morning this week because usually I work on it on Wednesdays. Wednesday afternoons and Thursday mornings, but I kind of lost a day yesterday because we didn't do this and we didn't have internet actually. We period. Didn't have internet. It, it was so, really just so uh, difficult know. to uh, do our normal things. We had to clean our office a little oh, bit. I know. That was kind of not Susie such a nice job. Susie went through the 2020 files. Uh, yep. Yeah. So we'd rather have spent our afternoon with you, really. Right. But um, so just so you know, you're gonna be looking for it tomorrow morning. It's actually gonna happen on Saturday morning. We have a new product, Marcia. We do, and it's kind of exciting. And I know it says Bernina made to create, but you know, if you have another brand machine, you could purchase this too. This is an amazing organizer. It has five drawers on each side. They swing out so you can fill it up with all your essential lovely goodies. You can have it as a grab and go. It also has a bottom drawer. It has a lock. And look at all that space. And Susie packages one of these up when we go to retreat, and she has everything she needs, everything Marcia needs, and everything I need, even though we thought we packed everything we needed. She just leaves it packed for retreats, and she's got, you know, if you need something, she has it in there, doesn't she? She does. And what's lovely about this is it actually has hang brackets. So you could hang this in your sewing studio as well, but it can also be used as a grab and go. And this is a new. Uh, item feature that we are excited to share with you and along with this new item we have can I talk about these suitcases yes that's we nice. have some wonderful uh, little trolleys these are made by blue fig company they're not specific to any brand machine they're like the Tudo bags they hold a uh, normal size regular size sewing machine these are new to our store and we have three different patterns we have this one which is called Dottie. We have a purple one and a royal blue one. And they are specially priced at $99.99. So, and not there's hundreds and hundreds of dollars. And they are quite there's nice. Pockets. And there's um, these little for you to put your notions and your threads. And then they Velcro to the side. Take the plastic out. Lots so you can and see lots the space. of pockets. This so, is. If you're in need of a case for a sewing machine, we've or, got what you need. Or even if you want a travel case to pack all your supplies in to go somewhere oh. with this telescoping handle and the rolled wheel um, bag, yeah. this is amazing to pack all your projects in. Actually, Susie has kind of one like this, only it's the Tudo brand. Uh -huh. And um, her son, it's bright blue, he, he uses that for a suitcase when he comes, when he goes away. It's kind of cute. So it has, you know, the nice wheels in the back, but it is a right. great uh, go go to bag. It is so that's special. And Susie has a question. Three, we have three. Three questions. Are the walking feet in stock yet? The walking feet are not in stock yet. So if you want a walking foot, you have to buy a 480 special edition machine. <laughs> <laughs> it's a true story, <laughs> and I'm very sad to say it, but it is the truth. Yeah, we've been waiting for so long. Um, pandemic. Oh. But rest assured, I have your name, and as soon as they come through the door, You'll we will them. be calling you and getting Absolutely. them back out to you. We're going to do a happy dance when they come in. I've been waiting we a are. long time. And Susie has two more questions. Okay. Do you need to order a book to be in Brenda's class? So there yeah. is there is no book for Brenda's class, but she does have some links, I believe, to some she of her favorites. She has some recommendations, but she um, talks about them during the class, I believe. However, so. she will tell you how to set up your material ahead of class and right what you and want she for may thread. she'll probably link like if you w wish to purchase books she'll probably link those because she will be communicating with you well before class day two as well once you're in that facebook group then she starts communicating with you about what you need and what to do to get ready for class and everything and else. honestly it is the best place to contact your teacher whether it's myself brenda or somebody else because we're monitoring that group ahead of time and we receive notifications when you ask a question. Well, the other good thing about taking a virtual class is we leave them up for a month. So if you, you know, were a little bit confused or Brenda may be going too fast for you or you want to do some more practicing, you can go back and you can watch the recording and you can stop it, work on something, press go again. So that's kind of one really, really nice thing about the virtual classes is that they are recorded for you so you can watch them over and over. And question number three. Yes, we want to know how the new store is 
Oh gosh. It looks so beautiful. It is. But it's so not ready for us to move in. No. (laughs) Um, You know, we had, did we give them a date? I think we did. And that's not going to happen. Wait, Marsha, please don't give them a new date. I'm not going to give you a new date. (laughs) It's lit again. Yeah. You know, it's really hard. Um, A lot of the crews that are working, you know, they have their workers and, you know, this pandemic, this COVID thing is real. They have, a lot of their workers are out or they have to quarantine for two weeks. Well, you know what? That happens if you have a crew of like, I don't know, two two or 10, um, it just slows everything down because they can only get so much done. I will, I will, yes, I will tell you though. uh, Yeah. And it's taking longer than longer than we thought for our cabinets and you know once you have them ordered are you going to cancel them because they're not here on time um no so it is beautiful store (laughs) and once we get you know what i think joy and i will go over there during one of these i think we'll slip over there once the floors are down now that's weeks away yet we'll give you a sneak peek and we'll do a little sneak peek tour it is coming along thank you so much for being so kind and patient with us we're not quite so patient here because we are just <laughs> filling in. We can because all move. of that new stuff. I know keeps and coming. it's too crowded up front. But we thank you so much for keep coming in, keeping our doors open, keeping um, buying the stuff until we get over there. It's going to be worth the wait. I am so excited. I can't hardly stand it. She can't. No, very much lesson in uh, patience for me. And like y'all, if y'all read my blog post quite a while ago you know I'm not patient but boy I tell you I'm learning I'm learning to be patient <laughs> like it or not <laughs> right <laughs> all right so oh the quilt behind us we showed you this a little bit last time but now we hung it up in all its glory we did, and it's like all the way to the ground to the ground and then like 12 inches over too so this is really really big she used all the fat quarter packs out of animal crackers for this you know, you probably could make two, and then she put borders on as I well. I think she did queen size, which I is so 90 too. by 108. So you probably, if you bought all these fat quarters, you could and some borders, you could probably make two quilts, two lap size quilts for absolutely a couple of little, a, a couple of little or big persons. And what is not to love about these adorable bow tied packages of fabric? I know they're really cute. What I love about this line. Honestly, I like all fabrics, but what I love about this is that the prints are smaller. They're not. And even you know? though it's maybe a juvenile topic, I, as a grown up, I think I'm going to have to make that quilt for my camper, Marsha. Susie absolutely loves it. She's a cowgirl, you know. At yeah. Heart. And what's that to love about she, So she picked the outside border, even though this isn't her quilt. Sarah Meldy, thank you very much, made it for us. Um, but she picked the cow border because she absolutely loves her cows. And this pattern is 369, and if you don't own this one yet, this is a go-to pattern because... we ta- It's worth repeating. We talked about it last time. Right. It's all fat quarters, but you can make from a baby size up to this queen-size quilt. And that's um, a lot of value in one package, isn't it? It really is. And you know, the blocks are made in such a fashion that... I can't remember. I think this is a block. I made a king-size quilt out of these, all in neutrals. Um, you could make, you just need to add more blocks and you can make whatever size you want. If you've got a California King or whatever, it's a great, this is a great go-to pattern and it's a fast sew, very fast sew. Speaking of cows, where do cows live? In a barn. In a barn, especially in Minnesota, right? Absolutely. We have a few of these kits left. This is a lovely, again, made by our own Sarah Mildy. This is a lovely, um, Applique, do they call this reverse applique where you put the pieces on the... It's it's reverse applique or kind of a stained glass technique, but, but without the without stained glass, the stained glass. So it's a black fabric and then all these are cut out and um, glued on and then she goes over them with um, just a straight stitch, um, not glued on there. I, ironed on, webbing. Iron, with fusible webbing. Um, and then she um, put a little bit of a... A uh, f- little bit of a polyester, I think an 80-20 or something in here. So like the clouds poof out. I absolutely love this. So this is um, a great kit and it is 30% off, I believe, including the pattern. And it's called the Big Old Barn. It is, the Big Old Barn. So this would be fun to make for a uh, quick little make um, for anybody um, or for yourself. So that's kind of fun. 
Um, so that's our special on... Okay, let's talk about the auction quilts. Auction quilts part two. Okay, <laughs> these are going on the website we now. Are, we are real people who make... Oh, look at there. She's removed all the extra friends from the front. I have, and I've, we, I kind of tried to hang them out so all the wrinkles weren't out there either. So Because if is, you watched us live two weeks ago, we had we, it was we had real bound up. We had a quilt tussle. We did. We lost. We did. So anyways, these are two kind of fun back seat of your car, whatever, um, just rocking fuzzy. Rocking chair. Yeah, rocking chair, anything. Just fun little um, comfort, quilts. comforting quilts. And they have, you know, These are made from homespuns and home flannels. Homespuns and flannels. This is what the back looks like. So this one here is reds and browns. And it's very tactile. So if you have a small child who likes to read stories in your lap. It's really soft. It is. Because it's been like, washed. Like in order to get this, I had to wash it like four times or something. I can't remember let when me I did have it. have that this way. Okay. And we can open up the next quilt. Okay. And this is also another ragtime quilt. So on the quilt auction, you're going to bid on both of these. One bid gets them both. And this one and is this really... One is made with um, again homespuns and a little bit of applique um, the more you wash it like we got a little of what are these called again Pills. filling that'll come off after you wash it a few more times um, but this again is another fun fun soft yummy ragtime quilt and this one's a little heavier so if you need a weighted blanket in your life it doesn't have that a one palace, is way heavier than that one yep. and I think it's because the fabrics the fabric were a little choices. more, um, they were more like um, men's shirting uh, weight. So the and last thing that I know you're waiting for. She's going to roll in. Is the sale fabrics. And I just want you to know that it matches the sewing machine. Not the same designer, but the colors. It is beautiful. All right. So this is all we have left of Tilda. And this is Bon Voyage. It is going Bon Voyage. It is going Bon Voyage. And I think we bought this right before pandemic. I think it came in then. Anyways, this is what we have left. It's $7 a yard for any of these that you want. And then the charm packs, this is all we have left. We have no fat quarter packs or anything else left. These are also half price. The pre-cuts, the Tilda charm packs are half price. So $7 a yard. These are half price. So that's what's being added in our virtual sale room. These will be out on our floor on Saturday morning. Yes, on Saturday morning. Yes. Yes, Susie. And he is asking, did I miss any Kimberbell news? Oh, you were going to bring the Kimberbell bag in. I, so... <laughs> We, no, you didn't miss any because we nearly forgot it. But So some of you did pre-order Kimberbell stabilizers. We have received our very first shipment of those. There are a few of the items in that Kimberbell line that we are still waiting for that are listed as pre-orders from our supplier. We've got a lot of them out there. We have a lot of them. So order with confidence. And the thing that I really wanted to bring in here is Kimberbell makes these wonderful slap bands. Yes. And they are colorful and they color coordinate with the Kimberbell colors. But I have OESD brand stabilizers in my house, but I bought a set of these slap bands because they have the same name verbiage as my OESD and I can just slap we'll them around. We'll bring those and demonstrate those for you next week. But we week. didn't have any specific news, but I do want you to know this. With our fill-in-the-blank program, they work as a pre-order. So, for example, if the February one you can order now. The January ones, we have shipped the uh, bags to those who have pre-ordered. And, and the embellishments. And the embellishment if kits, ordered. if you ordered them. But the designs go out on the 29th when our... Uh, Kimber Bell online classes that will be on this public page that anyone can view and my goal would be to send those out the night before so you would have your designs on Friday morning when Kendra does the does live the feed and if you want to sew along you can and for those of you um, that have asked this is one more extra thing that you get at pine needles that you might not get every place else is Kendra you a lot of you have said oh my gosh I don't know how to take it off my computer from the email onto my stick. Kendra is going to go through that process with you. And again, that will be recorded. So if you don't get it done right away, that morning she's going to show you how to uh, put the design on your stick. 
And then for the first few months anyway, she has told me that she's just going to kind of review that so that you don't need to get like, oh my gosh, Joy's not going to put my design on my stick anymore because she's going to go through with you. It's coming by email now because, and anybody can do this. Um, Kimber Bell is so gracious to let us do this because of the pandemic. Um, we have an unboxer in the we back do, that's louder do. than us. We but do. that's okay. There's She's more for the loop. But with those those design files, be sure that when you register that you verify your email on file with our store because I will send those designs to that email. And just know that some internet providers really don't love bulk emails. So be sure you check your right. spam file if you can not find it. And again, my goal would be I will send these out on the day before class. So class is the 29th. I will, it will be my goal to send them out one day ahead, but for sure I will send them out no later than the day of class. But it just depends on what our scheduling is here at the shop. Right, so far and near, everybody is welcome to um, participate in Kimberbell Club with us. And on our kits, we're gonna have something just a little bit extra. So, so no matter where you are, absolutely. you can join us. One more question. One more, um, the start date of pantry. The start date of pantry is January, and it is January, and again, we are waiting for our fabrics to they come in. Ship. <laughs> they are on that ship, so. But our target date was the 15th, 20th right. area, right. so our target date is always like the third week right. in January, or the third week of right. the month. And it is full, so it's good for all of those of you that um, pre-ordered, um, because it is totally full, and as soon as we have those boxes in the back here, we will pack those up. We'll probably put an email of the girls packing them all up and we will get those in the mail or you can pick, there's a lot of you that are picking them up here at the store just as quickly as we can. You know, those fabrics were due in December and you know, Moda has, a, has apologized and we apologize as well, but there's nothing we can do about the shipping, is there? Absolutely and we recently nothing. learned that there was a typhoon. I mean, it's not new news, but you don't think about typhoons affecting your shipping chain but it has affected our shipping right. chain and some of the things that have been delayed are due to cargo right. cargo things being stuck in safe harbors due to bad ocean travel we really pride ourselves on getting the orders out just as quickly as we can after they come in and this won't be any different i am so sorry um, but we just don't have the fabric yet. You're going to love them. But neither does anyone else have these new that is the truth. <laughs> that is the truth. You're not going to find them at a different store. And like I said, I made the, I, over Christmas vacation, I made the samples. So as soon as the boxes get shipped out, then we can share what the projects are with you as well. You're going to love them. They're really fun. All right. Well, I think that's about it for today. So it we is. can button this up. We can. Because <laughs> it's been so fun. It's been really fun to have you um, with us here again today. We're coming to you from Rochester, Minnesota. Pine Needles Quilt and Sew for the Marsha. And Joy. Show. Thank you so much for joining us. And until next Wednesday, you only got six days instead right. of seven. But until next Wednesday, we will keep, keep you in stitches. stitches. Thanks so much, everybody. Bye.